the green ones. Stop. Did it work? Yeah, combo sparrow. I think this one was hell to find. As the name suggests, these birds are rather common around Haru. They mainly live in plains or forests, but sometimes venture out to villages. Their diet consists of nuts and small insects. They look pretty cute when they jump around, but they don't have much love for people. It's just clear now. Oh. I mean, it's interesting that it's not here anymore, but it was such a much more interesting place with all that around. <laughs> Intentionally, they don't fire. Not on a spawn well. Oh, okay, it's not totally safe yet. of Mobley as uh, appear in the dark. Even the toughest Moblies become fragile when they are little more than a pile of bones. So they'll crumble after just a few attacks. However, as long as a skull remains intact, they'll continue to pull themselves back together and go on fighting. They are, have hard heavy horns and they hate strong light. Mobbling arm, an arm uh, mobbly bone that continues to move even after being detached from its body. Uh, the bone is thick enough to be used as a weapon but is extremely brittle and easily broken. The pink hero, this breed of hero is characterized by the pink tips of its feathers. Unlike the waterfront dwelling relative, the blooming hero, these live in grasslands or arid regions. They subsist on insects that live on the grass. They can often be found walking about searching for food, but uh, will fly away if they sense danger. On the water. Robert Drumstick, I didn't have that. This bit is tougher and chewer than a cellar steak. Tastes better when cooked. No. Oh. Me. Rockets. Look how rock shrine. Or force. Hmm. 
possible. Okay, simple enough. But I'm not really happy with what I did. I think I could have used that to... Yeah, I could have attached it there as well. And then grab the car here. I don't know. No, I I didn't need the car actually, just the ball back. Interesting. Very cool. The, will the physics work? Sater. Cool. Great. Kind of slow. But really cool that it works. Chest. I didn't find the chest. Uh, damage. Oh, you can open it. Why change like that? Frozen Night Surge. No, it's the only one? Yeah. Is cleaning this table. There has to be some interesting news. Mm -hmm. Oh, my torch were battleized Kakariko village. So I survey Thebes, I turn to its ring ruins. 
the village has become the latest tourist destination. It is interesting the rain ruins keeps on growing. Ah. Mm. I wonder what will happen with the when a big old ruin like that came out of nowhere. The achievement must be hard work if it got popular enough to be featured in the paper. Hi. Hello there. Pleasant evening. Where have you? Yeah. We are the one who was searching for the same bubble frog I was. Ah, it was you. Uh, if I'm not mistaken. Oh. After a bad curiosity got the better of me and I decided to go looking for a bubble frog in a cave. But that was not a great idea. Caves are dark and there's no way there's no way to know what's lurking around me there. Plus that strange duo. They just up and disappear from the lead stable. Oh. After that I oh what if I've spoken to you here before talking to Kilton and Colty? After that I didn't really know what to do with myself, so I did the same wandering I did some wandering and so thank you too. And up here. Then you know, if you decide that I'm a careful way, and I'll take comfort and safety over rewards and uh, riches any day. Uh. Uh, I'll go tomorrow, right? Mm -hmm. uh, we should make a conversation. I'm supposed to be on my way to the Rita Rui, Ring Ruins in Caprico Village. And again, when the sun goes down, the monsters come out, so maybe I'll wait till morning. Caprico Village. Uh. If you head south on the road from the stable, you come upon a crossroad that takes you to the mountains. Head all the way down the crossroad and you'll be in Caprico Village. It's a bit easier to find after the Rig Ruins fell, since you can use them as a landmark. Rig Ruins? Mm. You probably know the Fallings of the Ruins have been found all over the world since the people. Well, the ones at Caprico Village have been dubbed the Rig Ruins, owing to their distinctive circular shapes. There's also stone slabs there with the words like Sage and Demon King carvings on the script. Oh. The leader of our team, uh, the best in the world at the surface of the script, is heading up the investigation in person. It's all very, very exciting. I just wish the place was a little easier to get to. Oh. I should get going too. My fellow researchers will start wondering where I am. <sighs> and again, the monster come out for force tonight, so why risk it? I'll depart at set up. Okay, so I'll have to stay here. I need to see oh. you and do. I uh, got some money now. Let's go trouble play in a bed. What's hey. the vision? Sleep in a lady bed, not only we wake up more energized, and later the horse gods may also share mystical message. It's a very popular choice for our customers. I, what I don't like is this may share a mystical message. So there's a chance I won't get anything. Let's try it. If you do, we would like to do. Mm. Okay, press well. Mm. We have a lady, the horse of gods, the god of horse, uh, who grants quicker hooves and thicker hides. In Northeast Haru, near Stable, in Akala, I am waiting. Oh, so now you're in Akala. Uh, yeah, I cannot avoid Akala, right? Nobody told me to go to Terry. No, somebody mentioned it, but... Okay. Oh. Good uh, afternoon, did you hear a message? It says for Lodgy. Oh, it says you present you with one point. Good. Ah. Say, Link, have you heard about the Trouble Resource Domain? What's polluting? Okay, you told me. Uh, what about the guy here? Not here either. <laughs> uh, that monster has showed up his face around here again. Thanks to you, I don't need to worry anymore. Ah. Something would be perfect if my, if my brothers were my helpful brothers. And Isra and uh, Yolero, they don't help at all. Isra will look for some farming tools related to Princess Zelda, and Yolero is lacking off somewhere. I haven't seen him around. Oh, but don't worry, I can do enough work for the three of us. You can rely on Wetland's table anytime you're in the area. 
Okay, you. Uh -huh. Do something else. Like I said, I should really start heading to a village. Yeah. Ah. Uh. But you open up you just head towards the ring shaped thing in the distance. That's one of the ring ruins. I don't know how to talk about the spot, it's a research team as well as the public. For warning, you run into some tourists. They've been flocking to the ruins lately. Ring ruins. Ah. Probably know the followings of the ruins have been found all over the world since the people. Uh, the wall was covered with ring ruins, ring shape, there are those stuff left. Oh. The MT, uh, the investigations, there are scientists. Wish the place was a little easier to get oh. to. The sugar going to. Then again, with the setup, it will be easier for monsters to see me. Probably the best way. Can I take a picture of Coco? No, but yes. Coco. Uh, villages often raise these birds for their eggs. But some people actually keep them as pets. They can't fly, but can fly their wings and bind fiercely if picked up. They usually call creatures, but if you're a person with either a term of them, well. It's not the light driver, is it? No, it's later. Ah, that's a nice picture. Uh, it could be closer to the village, but okay. Does it fly in the fruit? Uh, the spirit of vice uh, has taken the form of this giant dragon, making its home in the Ladero region. It's said to have served the spring of wisdom since ancient times. The ice that coats its body can make the surrounding area freezing cold, but nature bears no ill will towards people. Few have seen it in the current age. Sabah. Sabah? Don't call me on this, but I heard there are strange ruins in Kabrigo village. Are you sure about that? It could be a lie. And by strange, I mean ring shaped. Who ever heard of such a thing? I mean. You know that since the people, there's been no shortage of strange sightings and walk discoveries. But ring shaped ruins? Can you get more bizarre than that? Yeah. Close there, sir. Say, are you familiar with Zora's domain? It's found just past the Lanier Wetlands to the east. Aww. I used to source fresh fish from the Zora, but the sludge started falling from the sky and polluted the water. No, they don't catch many fish anymore. Wretched, yeah. But enough of that. To happier matters, yeah. welcome to Dimby's Finding Goods. T uh, please take a look at our carefully curated offerings. Bye uh -huh. bye. Uh -huh. Uh, no, we'll be good. Can I just tell you how it's never? 
or even when you are returning. Keep name is fine goods in mind for all your mercantile needs. Uh, Concrete Village, Riverside Stable. Yeah, the stable first. Okay, toss you at them. Ah, okay. Uh, if I use the mask, you will charge fast, won't it? Okay, perfect. I don't have to spend uh, bombs on you. What gives? Hey! What? Return. Oh! They dropped that. Where are you? What now? Response. More rock. A bouncy device. Looks totally safe. together do oh. sneaky elixir grants uh, mid-level stealth effect which calms nerves and silence food falls Allows you to move about undetected by monsters and animals. Ok. 
Okay, that isn't enough. of those how far can I go with the maximum possible You vanish. Oh, let me mark where I am. Uh, monster. Tail, a highly flexible stretchable tail, fused a weapon to add a slash, a lashing with black quality to attacks or quickly the creature to make a leaks. Oh. Uh, here we go. Uh, album. The next one is... The fish-like thing. Here. Okay. That's the next memory. That's definitely slated because I left like that. I need to remember to get by here some other time to check if it's still like that or if it gets up right. Precise table, Kapuka Village. That's the okay. That's the rooks weapon. It costs diamonds. Tooth I didn't have yet. This tooth, this high knock tooth, is almost unbelievably big. Attached to an arrowhead to increase its attack power or brew it with an elixir. It's huge. Would it make the arrow heavier? It will fall faster. 
Vogue fruit, cacti found in the Gorondo Desert bear this sweet fruit. It's naturally isolated, so when cooking into a dish, it provides resist resistance against electricity. I'm hoping the deer is closer to the eye of the drawing. Over here? Yeah. I have no idea if it's close to the eye. Hyrule will bow down before me. How is that possible? <sighs> so brute force will not be enough. The secret stone of the Zonai. <laughs> How interesting. the Molduga threat, they can swim on rock. They'll just get to the edge of the desert and be stuck there. <gasps> you shouldn't the other Gerudo have rounded ears like Gandalf. Or this Gandalf have pointy ears. Like the rest of the Gerudo. Oh. <laughs> Pain. Mm. Oh, please help. Princess Zelda, her recipe as written. Don't, don't improvise. Who, who suggested, who's the monster beat? Uh, mm. uh, I think animal beat, right? Maybe. Uh, uh. First, uh, first rule of cooking, always follow the recipe. Princess Zelda's meat and rice ball. Combine plain raw meat, honey rice and rock salt. 
this flavorful comforting dish is sure to fill your, uh, you with energy. But be sure to follow the recipe to the letter. Damn it, it's raining now. Locks. Okay. Lock. Lock club. Huh. Oh, interesting. The ever being logs. Wow, I think the pattern should be Give me more bonus than regular logs. But every mean logs have made every mean weapons, every mean club and stuff. But this one is still considered a normal log, even though it doesn't look exactly like a normal log. to the end. Right. I think I hit the ceiling. Wait, what? No. Oh. Okay. No. Why are you sliding? Stop sliding, stop sliding. Uh, okay. I don't think I'm able to turn it here. No, it has hit. Stop rotating. <laughs> hmm. 
More logs. <laughs> Whoa. All right. Ah, there's a chest. They did way too much waste of time. He bangs in the middle. I didn't call him in the war. Perfect. That's not useless, but that's definitely not practical. I don't think Rara knew how powerful his magic was. Shoot. Uh, really sure. Okay, so we shoot. Only that. Okay. Major waste of time. Complete. Just out of curiosity, uh, 54. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's lagging. All right. Interesting. Uh, Interesting. Great. You know what? I'm I'm gonna say this is favorite. I probably no. Once I get enough and I can just spend some nights, I, I may for some reason feel that. <laughs> 